make no mistake, Creon. It is you who bears responsibility for this evil omen, for our altars have all been defiled by birds with carrion from the son of Oedipus, who still lies rotting above the earth. And so the gods no longer accept sacrifices from us, for these animals have all consumed of a dead man's blood. Consider this, Creon, before you respond. Everyone stumbles and makes mistakes, especially kings. But when someone strays from the path and accidentally does something wrong, it is important that he fix what he has broken. Stubbornness is just another sign of stupidity. Where is the power in re-killing the dead? You must bury the son of Oedipus and atone for your errors. This is Margaret Atwood inviting you to join us on February 23rd at 5 p.m. Eastern Time for The Nurse Antigone, a live reading of Sophocles' Antigone on Zoom, featuring acclaimed actors and a chorus of frontline nurses to help frame a powerful, guided discussion about the unique challenges faced by nurses today. I'll be playing the prophet Tiresias, and I hope to see you there. <laughs>